Praise God, YouTube Christians, let's go. John 3, 16. For God so loved the world that he gave his only begotten son that whosoever believes in him should not perish but have everlasting life. Listen, I'm trying to warn people. I know my videos seem unloving, harsh. I'm calling people out. I'm trying to warn people. The lukewarm church is going into the tribulation. So Jesus said, I counsel you. I'm trying to counsel you. The rapture is coming. September 9, 10, or 11 is what I'm looking at. The 25th of Elul, the summer fruit harvest, Amos 8, Micah 7, 2. I'm just trying to warn people. God does love the world so much that he gave his only begotten son, that whosoever believes on him should not perish, but have everlasting life. So Jesus does love you. The Father loves you. He died for you to reconcile you to his Father so we could live all eternity with God the Father, God the Son, God the Spirit in the new heaven, on the new earth. It will be incredible absolutely incredible. So I'm sorry if it sounds like I'm too harsh, if I'm arguing with people, but that's all I do. People come against the pure teachings of the word of God. And that doesn't mean I have everything right, because I know I don't. But I'm telling you, God loves you. Christ loves you. Died for you. You're running out of time to make the rapture. And if you miss the rapture, you will have to be willing to die for him in the tribulation to show that you believe in him. That's all I'm saying. So praise God, Jesus loves you and did an incredible thing for you. He did it all. He paid it all on the cross. He said, it is finished. You don't finish his work. He finished his work. So I love you. God loves you. Jesus loves you. Praise God. Believe in him. In Jesus' name, amen.